Did you know that atoms are made up of protons, neutrons, and electrons? All matter is made up of tiny particles that have atoms. In an atom, you'll find a proton, a neutron, and an electron. An atom has a nucleus at its center and an electron cloud that surrounds it. Protons and neutrons are in the nucleus of an atom, while electrons are in the electron cloud orbiting the nucleus. The electron cloud has different energy levels called shells or orbitals in which electrons are found. Each energy level or orbital has a limit to how many electrons it can hold. In an atom, protons are positively charged, electrons are negatively charged, and neutrons don't have an electric charge, they're neutral. Protons and neutrons have approximately the same mass, while the mass of electrons are insignificant compared to a proton or neutron. A proton weighs 1,836 times more than an electron. That is why the atomic mass of an element in a periodic table is equal to the number of protons and neutrons in an atom. Electrons contribute little to the weight of an atom. Atoms can lose and gain electrons by forming bonds with other atoms. When an atom loses an electron, it becomes positively charged because there are less electrons in the atom and electrons are negative. When an atom gains an electron, it becomes negatively charged because there are more electrons in the atom. Let's review what we just learned. Atoms are the building blocks of everything in the universe. Atoms are made up of protons, neutrons, and electrons. Each atom has an electron shell that surrounds the nucleus. At the center of an atom, you will find a proton and a neutron. Electrons are found orbiting the nucleus of an atom. The electron cloud contains different energy levels known as shells. The atomic mass of an atom is the sum of both of protons and neutrons. The mass of electrons is tiny compared to protons and neutrons. Protons are positively charged, electrons are negatively charged, and neutrons have no charge.